As part of a demonstration, I'll start with the great stops. We have the open diapason, eight foot. It's nice and creamy, full sound. Next we have a whole flute, which is a special type of whole flute because the pipes are triangular in form. It resembles that of a clarabelle. And a stop that which most organs do not have on their grate, we have a Kamba, eight foot. Next is the principal. The harmonic flute. Mutation, the only mutation on this organ, the 12th. Used in a combination of at least an 8 foot. And then the 2 foot 15th. We have an extremely bright mixture on the grate, which is probably the, lo ugh, the loudest stop on this organ. Used in combination with the chorus. Probably a stop that should need a 16 foot rank to support it. And then we have the trumpet. Furthermore, these are couplers. We have the great sub-octave coupler. We have its octave coupler of the great. Three more couplers for the swell, the sub-octave, the unison, and its octave. And also for the choir, the sub-octave, the unison, and its octave. The next stop is the choir. We have the Liebigt Gedacht. The very soft Dolce Hano. Flauto Transverso. and the piccolo. One of my favorite stops on this organ, the clarinet. And of course the tremolo, the choir sub octave, choir octave, swell to choir, sub octave, swell to choir, and swell to choir octave. Next we have the swell manual. We have a beautiful 16 foot board on that goes all the way down to the low C. Open diapason which could be a violin diapason Rue flute or chimney flute. Salacional. Its brother, the Voix Celeste. On this organ, if only the Vox Celeste is selected, the Solutional comes out with it automatically. The four foot principle. 
a very bright forefoot that gives the impression that a two foot is added with it. If you combine it with the open diapason, it gives the effect as an example, the eight, the four, and the two foot principal chorus of the great compared to the eight foot and four foot principal chorus of the swell, the great, the swell, almost an effect that the two foot is added with it. <clears throat> we have a two foot mixture. This is a special mixture. It is not as high and bright as the great mixture. It is only a two rank mixture. Over here, it becomes ranks of an eight foot and a four foot. It's a very special mixture. I'll speak about it later. We have the normal cornopian trumpet effect, baroque trumpetish. We have an oboe. And then this two foot flutina. This was originally the Vox Humana. I have no idea why they replaced the stop, but apparently it was not a very good stop, the Vox Humana, so they replaced it with a two foot. I would much prefer that they replaced it with a four foot flute instead of a two foot flutina, which I don't use very much because it sounds as if a mixture has been added. And then of course the tremolo, swell sub octave, swell octave. The pedal division only has three stops. We have our open diapason 16 foot. And then our board on. A violoncello, eight foot. And then the usual couplers of great to pedal, swell to pedal, swell, octave to pedal, which most organs do not have. This comes in handy. Swell oboe, swell forefoot, and with our pedal bore that can reach the high G, we can get that is the high G, this G, two G's above middle C, which we are able to get because the pedal stops are so few. Then the choir pedal. And then we have a pedal octave coupler. So we can have the pedals. And then we add the four foot coupler of the pedal octave to add a octave coupling to the pedal for bigger strength. If you see these stops, you won't think that there's anything special about them, especially funny stops. Um, if you look at this clarinet, there's no other mutation, but what if I want to add a sesqualteria? There is no ter to couple. If I couple as an example, to play a third above, I'll get the sesquateria. This is with a two foot piccolo. I am transposing a third above. And I think it's this one. Okay, very nice sesquateria sound, but to play it on one manual, if we add the clarinet to it, and the choir to the great, we get the same effect.
So we get the effect of a sesquel terrier with the clarinet. Also with the cornet stop, we do not have all those mutations. Choir, the flutes of 842 plus the clarinet will actually give us that effect. Of course, the organ has to be tuned properly for that. Um, also, the grate does not have any 16 foot stops. We can add one. Brlorok plenum. I added the swell 1684, this funny mixture, and the cornopian swell. I'm going to add a swell with its octave on the swell uh, on the choir. I have the eight foot gedacht. I'll add its sub octave. And then we get, if we just add some beef for the pedal. There we have a 16 foot added. Now, to speak about this funny mixture, with an oboe, Okay, there we have the oboe with the eight and the four foot principal stops. If we add the mixture, it actually sounds as if a clarion four foot reed is added. Also, if we add that and that, It sounds as though there is a 16 foot reed. Let's add that. That's the purpose of this mixture. It doesn't have the purpose of a bright mixture. It's a mixture that is twofold. It adds the effect of a four foot clarion and in somewhat in the lower register the effect of a 16 foot bassoon on the swell. Also there are very few of the same type of stops. Stops that are the same. We have a Liebig gedacht 8 foot on the choir. We have a 16 foot Liebig borden on the swell. If you take that and add the swells octave to the choir, we get a type of flute celeste. Sound of a flute celeste. Add in the 16 foot Liebig Bordon to its brother, the 8 foot Liebig Gedacht, and you'll get a flute celeste. The pedal board is two and a half octaves. It goes all the way up to a G, which most organs only go up to an F, and some only go up to an E. Most Baroque organs only go up to a D. Besides that, the organ has swell boxes for the choir and the swell. It also has something special which most organists will not know. This is called on the right hand side the crescendo pedal. German organ players would know it as a roll sweller. Its purpose is to add stops from the softest to the loudest in succession. I'm holding a chord of a C in first inversion, and if I open it slowly, it will add the stops from softest to the loudest. To basically a full organ. Works well with German romantic music that require this.